Hi, my name is Hannah Gray, and I go to Parishville Hopkinton Central School in New York. And today I'm going to be tying a fly called the Flashy Dr. Seuss Caterpillar. These are going to be my tools that I use along the way. This is called the vise, which holds the hook so you can tie the fly. And this is the bobbin, which holds the thread. And this is the finishing tool, which ties the knot at the end. And these are my scissors for cutting off supplies. And these are the materials. And this is the hook. First, you put the hook in the vise. Then, you wrap it with thread all the way to the back of the hook, then to the middle. Then, you cut off the extra string and that in my little bag. And then, you take the schneel. and tie it on. And then cut off the extra. And then wrap it back to the back of the hook. And then wrap back forward. And then tie on the hackle feather. And cut off the extra. Wrap to the back of the hook. And then you take the peacock curl and tie it on in the middle. And then you pull the top one back so it looks like two big wings. And then wrap back to the back of the hook. And then to the front again. And then you tie on the crystal flash. And wrap to the back of the hook again. And then you go almost to the front of the hook but not quite all the way. And then you wrap the chenille around the hook to where, yeah, to where it's going to hit you in the chin, like this. And then tie it off. But this time you don't cut it off, you build the hump. You have to kind of fix up the hump and sometimes you have to take it apart. And tie that off. And cut it off this time. And then you take the crystal flash and start wrapping it around the fly. It doesn't matter how you do it. Then you tie that off. 
then you cut it off. Then you take the two peacock curl strips that you made and then you pull them to each side. And you pull this one to this side. Don't worry about cutting off the extra pieces. And wrap the hackle feather in nice even spaces. Tie that off. and then cut it off. And cut the antennas to the length you like it. And then use the finishing tool and wrap the whole thing over. Cut it off. Open the vise, and then you're done. And that is all there is to it.